Um, this plane does not go upwards. Whoops. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play Kerbal Space Program. My name is Weasel, and in the last episode, we shot a Kerbal into orbit around Kerbin. Carlot Kerman is currently orbiting around Kerbin, and there is a slight problem. We can't get her back. Yep, we are out of fuel, so I can't really affect the orbit, meaning she's going to have to circle around Kerbin for, well, until we research something so we can get her back. Quite depressing, isn't it? Well, we're not helping anyone if we're pouting. Let's build a new rocket and gather some science because we really need more science to get parts to build cooler rockets. Totally want a science compartment here to gather data. I think this will do the trick. We got a few parachutes here. So hopefully our Kerbal is going to survive this. Safe schlong MK1. Can't help it. So the idea is to just propel us out of the atmosphere, gather some scientific data, and then come back down. Here goes nothing. Let's just hope this one stays stable. Wobbling a little bit left and right, but I think we're doing okay. Here, this is a little bit too hot. A little too hot for comfort. All right, let's detach. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I hope these things are gonna be fine. It should be enough to- Yep, shoot us 222,000 meters. Which is quite a lot. I don't even have to fire these bad boys up. That is pretty impressive. Those rockets work really well. Right, now that we're out here, we're gonna open up our materials bay. The microgravity has greatly affected the growth of crystalline structures. Loose objects are also flying around the bay in a very messy but fascinating way. Well, we got 2.8 science in case this thing goes down. We might get the science if we recover the vessel. Whee and we're going down again. Okay, it's time now to burn against the fall. Hopefully we can make something happen. Oh, we're so fast. It's actually helping. <laughs> this seems very ineffective. Okay, now we will detach. Oh, no! No, I hit the parachutes. We're sailing down the wrong way. Oh, we lost our... Oh, this is not good. Yeah, that didn't survive. I don't feel too comfortable. With the parachutes, they're not doing too well. Ah, there you go. They opened up. We're good. What if I cut the parachute? Oh! That'll work. Let's just hope that one parachute is enough. And we... Well, at least the Kerbal survived. I think we're gonna have to rework this design a little bit, but we weren't... It wasn't too bad. I'm just gonna add another science compartment in the hope that that will do the trick. Woo! Man, this looks always so dramatic. I love it. This time we have two science compartments. Double science! If we can bring him down safely, that is. Woohoo! Let's hope those parachutes open. All right, it's time to gather some data at roughly 1,100 meters per second. And it's time to come back down again. Oh, did I open the parachutes already? Whoops. Uh-oh, we're too fast. Alright, it might even- it might work. Ah, we're the wrong way around again. And... We landed safely! No one died! You survived, congratulations! All the data, that's great actually. I will gladly go for stability. I think it's time to improve the safe schlong. Alright, having those nose cones is great. Ooh, radial decouplers! That's awesome! We're gonna have a lot of fun with that. Well, this better works. Parachutes on each one of them. I hate wasting good parts. I think two are enough on this. This one is even gonna go higher. We have much less air resistance, actually. And I hope that I can recover all the parts with the parachutes. All right, let's orbit around the planet and gather some science in the safe schlong MK4 at this point. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, they're already wobbling around. That can't be a good sign. I trust my engineers. Wait, I'm my own engineer. Oh no, we're doomed. It's not falling apart, so I'm gonna consider that a win. What if we like go a little sideways, just a little bit. Oh, whoa, no good. No good. Okay, stop, stop spinning. Eh, it doesn't matter. Even if they spin, who cares? That's totally fine. How high are we going to go? A only 120,000, actually that's surprising. All right, let's add a maneuver. Uh, 
one minute burn. That's quite a lot, actually. It's a little bit more than I think I can burn. Uh, I'm gonna have to cancel this. We're gonna need that to come back down to Earth and break our fall a little bit. While we're at here, we can do some science. Oh, we're not getting any signs anymore. Ah, oh, what a shame. I really have to start pointing this thing sideways to get into orbit and not when I'm up there. Oh man, this rocket is way too fast for me to tilt it in any way. There you go. That's too much. Too much. Oh yeah. Okay, okay, okay. I can work with this. Oh, well, it's a 45 degree angle. Could be worse. Oh, I don't know if it could actually be worse. Oh, stay steady. Stay, for freak's sake, stay steady. It's time for some science. Oh yeah, that's good science. It's perfect science. I guess my best bet is to kind of slow down a little bit. As best as you can. And that's it. It's a little fast. And it's a little early to tell. They might make it actually. No! No! Well, we didn't make it. You know, we don't need all of this stuff. <laughs> yeah, these little guys are gonna give us a little extra kick. Oh yeah, I'm totally going to research data here on the ground. That's fine. Well, let's just hope it doesn't topple over because this seems really unstable. Oh, here goes nothing. Woohoo! Time to do research! 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 <laughs> oh no! Time to detach! Time to start the other rocket. No, that's the wrong way. That's the wrong way. Oh, I forgot to put your parachutes on this one. Well, might as well detach. And yeah, I'm, I think then we're gonna save ourselves here. Very good. Whoops. I have no idea how high we're gonna go. Well, let's find out. Whoa, that's fast. Time to do some research. Yes, keep that. Keep that data. Guys, it's time to open the parachutes. Oh, wrong way. My bad. It looks kind of dorky, though. Love it. This is so slow. So slow. Nailed it. Well, I guess it doesn't make sense to have several of these labs with you, but at least I have one. And we saved the whole rocket. <laughs> we can build planes. I want to build planes. All right, it's time to build a plane. I have never built a plane in this game, and I'm so excited for it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is this is not flying. <laughs> this is not supposed to fly at all. Um, I have no idea if this is gonna work, and I'm worried to sacrifice a Kerbal. <laughs> well, I guess if everything goes tits up, at least I have decoupler and parachutes, so only the plane will be lost. I hope. So, how do I control this? Oh, this is not a good sign, is it? Well, that, nope, that didn't work at all. Well, at least nobody died. That's a start, right? Well, I mean, maybe this will work better. Oh, well, I guess here goes nothing. Uh, how do I fly upwards with it, though? Uh, I guess we're flying. Quick, do some research. Yes, sure. <laughs> I don't think that's working. I am flying, in all fairness. Well, what a shame. I think I'm gonna have to drop the rest there. Doubt I can land this anywhere. Bye bye, little plane. <laughs> it just keeps going. Well, I have no idea if this one is gonna fly, but it looks super dorky. I will call it the Dork Master. And it looks like it's going to explode. Maybe we have more luck than we think we do. Okay, this is the worst runway ever. Oh, I don't have lights. Damn it. Um, This plane does not go upwards. Whoops. I think I was missing something, and I have no idea what it was. Well, maybe we just need more tires. Uh, wings. That's the word I'm looking for. Wings weasel, not tires. Yeah, this looks like it's going to work just fine. The Dark Master 2 ready for liftoff. Okay, looking good so far. Looking good. All right, let's speed us up and... I guess we're flying. It's, 
I guess you could call it that. A little too fast here for my own. Oh my god! This is not good. This is not... Okay. Oh, uh, this is really bad. I think this is not how planes work. Oh my god, I would vomit so hard. Abandon ship. Plane. Whatever. Let's get out of here. At least we're safe and sound. That's something. Just a little bit unstable. Other than that... Not too bad. Not too bad. Yeah, that's not worrisome at all when the engineer says, I think it could fly? Well, I have my doubts. Let's observe some mystery goo while we're launching. I think we can throttle, go a little bit slower here. I mean, I don't think this should fly, but it does. Oh, okay, I can go somewhat sideways. How is this even possible? Let's break some sort of speed record. Oh my god, I'm gonna be sick. Uh, uh, this is the worst plane ever. That is bad. That is very bad. Uh, disembark. Whew. I don't have enough money to launch this vessel anymore. Oh, no. We ran into financial troubles. Ah, uh, hiring the last Kerbal was too expensive. I have zero left. I am completely bankrupt. This is how you lose the career mode in Kerbal Space Program. What a shame. I'm gonna have to... <laughs> restart the game and hopefully... If you want me to try the career mode again in Kerbal Space Program, let me know. We could also just build rockets. Leave your thoughts in the comments below. I'm Weasel, I'm out, and I hope to see you around. Bye-bye! <laughs> that totally did not. That was the, the worst possible thing that could happen in that situation. And they're all coming for you. They really want my a piece of me. God, these guys won't leave me alone. Oh god. Watch out, Boo's here. Oh no. Oh no! <laughs> god! Oh, there you are. Watch this one. <laughs> oh, come on. Fucking. Wait. Oh, you just ate me. You ate me. Oh. Now you can't eat you. You're Sam's